Hey, Elon, is um, Grok coming to uh, Tesla uh, vehicles before Optima? Um, well, I'm not sure what you mean by that, but the, yeah, I think you'll be able to ask Grok things in Tesla, sure. Um. So Tesla's AI is secretly making decisions for you right now. And Kim Jarvis has exposed how it actually works. Let's take a look. And speaking about saying hello to a new year, you can also say hello to your vehicle. <laughs> like, where are you going with these transitions? And it will respond to you because... It now has a new AI assistant, possibly. Yes, this has been quietly integrated in. It actually wasn't even related to the holiday update. This came in on a separate uh, software update, but it, people hadn't really been aware of it because it is such a discreet little touch inside your Tesla UI. But when, you're, when you when you press the button on the steering wheel, the speak button, you're able to say hi or hello. And it used to be command not understood, is what Tesla said to almost everything that wasn't hey, turn up you know, the HVAC to this setting or whatnot. But now, if you say hi or hello to it, it actually responds back to you saying hello or hi. Now, this might seem like a small feature right now, but here's what makes this absolutely crucial. Tesla is laying the groundworks for something much larger. And if you think about it, they're not just rushing to compete with other manufacturers' AI assistants. They're building this from the ground up with their own technology. And here's what I love about this. Tesla's approach of starting small but building on their own foundation makes complete and perfect sense to me. They're not just trying to catch up with existing voice assistants. They're creating something entirely new that could integrate deeply with both vehicle and X's ecosystem. Hey, Elon, is um, Grok coming to um, Tesla uh, vehicles before Optima? Um, well, I'm not sure what you mean by that, but the... Yeah, I think you'll be able to ask Grok things in Tesla, sure. Um, would they be would they be run locally or would they be run through, no. um, through the API? Through the API. I mean, these uh, AIs are, I mean, they use quite a bit of inference compute. You see, now the brilliance here isn't just about having an AI assistant in your car. Imagine if Tesla invested in X.AI and integrated Grok more deeply. This could actually create a seamless experience between your online interactions and also your vehicle. But this is where it gets interesting. A potential Tesla investment in X.AI wouldn't just be about social media or vehicles in isolation. It's about creating an entire ecosystem where AI enhances every interaction. And that's whether you're tweeting or driving. Grok AI is just the beginning of Tesla's AI revolution. And if you're thinking about getting Tesla, please click below to watch my next video where we compare the Model Y and the Juniper. It'll help you decide if you should buy now or whether you should wait. So guys, hit subscribe for my next EV updates and drop a robot emoji in the comments if you test Grok in your Tesla. My name's Des from the Electric Oracle and I look forward to seeing you in my next video.